Today, we're talking all about Magic School AI. Here in CCSD21, we use the free version across the district. This is just one example of many generative AI tools that you can find online for teachers. Please follow our AI guidance for teachers, which is linked in the description box below. I'll be referring to the infographic throughout this video. This information tells you all about best practices to follow when using tools like Magic School AI. Magic School AI is like a wizard that can help you get started creating anything you need for class. Lesson plans, text levelers, translations, a presentation generator. Really, if you can think of it, Magic School AI can do it. Keep in mind, AI is meant to be a starting point to help you generate ideas, but ultimately you have to double check the content for accuracy and bias. To get started, we're going to create a free account with our district Google account. When you sign in for the first time, you'll be prompted to choose which grades and subjects you teach to better customize the experience. No worries though, you can always specify a different grade level or subject when you're actually using the AI generation features. Once our account is created, we'll see the Magic Tools page. This is like a main menu for all the different features Magic School AI has to offer. Sometimes it's hard to know where to start. You can begin by searching for a specific use case here to see which tool best matches your needs. You can also star a specific feature to find it easier in the future. Let's try some of the tools to show examples of what Magic School AI is capable of. First up is the depth of knowledge questions feature. This allows us to generate questions tailored for four levels to determine how well a student understands the topic. We'll choose the grade and the topic. Adding more details will help Magic School AI better tailor the questions to your needs. Click here and take a look at the questions that Magic School AI generated. You can choose to copy the questions and paste them into another document. And you can edit the questions if you need to tweak something. There's a read aloud feature level one. And you can even save these questions in the output history section of Magic School AI. Something really cool is that you can translate the answers that Magic School AI provides without having to jump to another page, just like this. Let's pause right here and see where we fall in our stoplight from the AI guidance. Generating questions and translating would fall into the yellow category, meaning we need to double check that the translations are correct before sharing them with students. Anytime you use AI to generate something to share with students, please see where it falls in the spotlight first. Next, let's try the text translate tool. We can either paste the text or upload a worksheet. For example, here I have a worksheet that I'm uploading. Now I can copy the words and paste them into my Google Doc. If you're translating a document with students' personal information, please remove that first so we can protect our students' privacy. Text Leveler is an awesome way to make text understandable for any reading level. Simply paste the text or upload a PDF and choose an appropriate reading level for your students. Please respect copyright and fair use laws. We don't want to upload or paste text from our paid resources since that violates the terms of use. This tool is appropriate for small amounts of text, not entire bodies of work. Another cool feature is the YouTube video questions generator. We're going to paste a link from a video here and choose what type of questions we want and how many. Once you generate the questions, Magic School AI even provides the timestamps so you can scroll through the video and see the exact spot the information was pulled from. Classroom management is another cool feature. 
Enter a prompt that describes what you're looking to address in your class, and Magic School AI will come up with some great ideas. Next, Presentation Generator is a great example of a Magic School AI feature that creates a downloadable file. Here we'll enter all our information and get specific about the details that we want included or excluded. Now we'll export to Google Slides. Look at that. We have the beginnings of our next lesson. After we make our own edits to check for accuracy and align the information with our district's curriculum, and perhaps add some pictures in color, this will be perfect. Like we said earlier, AI is a great starting point, but it's not always perfect. That's why we need to add our final edits before sharing this out. Next, we'll check out Reina. Reina is a chatbot that's great for quick, on-the-spot questions and answers. Reina offers great follow-up questions after generating an answer. This could be a great opportunity for you to use Reina as a class and ask students to give you questions to ask. Your chat history is saved on the right-hand side in case you need to refer back to a past conversation. In output history, this will save all your past interactions with the features from the Magic Tools page. With the free version, we're able to go back to the most recent conversations by clicking the title here. You can also click the trash to delete them. The Resources tab contains any previously saved resources like we saw earlier with the depth of knowledge questions. Love is a great spot to get inspired by how other teachers around the world are using Magic School AI on X. If you ever want to customize an AI feature, you can click Create a Custom Tool. Here you can choose specific details so the next time you generate content, it will follow the specific guidelines that you specify. You can share the customized tool with other teachers here. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss our next video.